just wish you were playing with me. You are the best Kung Lao. That's I would love to be able to play some of these old PS2 games online with people. I mean, I know it's technically possible, like with emulators and things like that. And with some of the games linking like directly, not using servers, you could probably get some of the old games to to work together. But uh, yeah, I don't imagine it'd be too easy. Uh, it's good eating. It's now. Yep, it's good eating it now. I completely read that wrong. I was like, what the hell? Kibasa earlier, you put the spice and all that used on Discord sports to share my cooking. I nothing wrong with that, man. Nothing wrong with that at all. One of these days, I'll try that kielbasa with, what'd you do, like hot sauce and stuff, I think you said? I have to try that someday. Razor hat. <laughs> Freak, now I'm hungry and it's like 10 p.m. right now. Perfect time for a midnight stat snack. Man, holy shit, I'm stuttering over here. All right, let's, uh, let's get into the game view, shall we? There we go. Let everybody see what's going on here. Maybe turn on some audio for the game as well. Yeah, so... I was a few minutes late, by the way, Nate. I, I saw your little message there, bud. Uh, my birthday, obviously, 13 minutes from now, uh, my time. So, Mr. Noodle and I, we were talking about whether we wanted to do, like, birthday tomorrow morning or uh, after I finished the stream or whatever, and she decided just to give me the presents before the stream. So, yeah, it's a couple minutes late because of that, and also I had to get some pizza in me before uh, before I started the stream up because I was hungry man yes I am hype <laughs> I, <laughs> I I'm glad you're hype but I know I'm gonna let you down <laughs> so I apologize Rue happy early but not early birthday thank you Rue I appreciate it man yeah I mean it's close enough you know you won't be that bad Oh, no, I don't think you're going to be that bad. I think I'm going to be that bad, though. So you got versus mode. You got co-op. So play together through the game. That's pretty cool. And then just single player. What is content? What is what is this? Arenas, concept art, movies, photos, suffering 2 demo, Mortal Kombat 2, and credits. That's cool, man. Wait, is that Mortal Kombat 2? Is that like the full Mortal Kombat 2 game? Oh, it's locked. I imagine you probably have to beat the game or something to unlock that. That's still, that's really cool, though, that that's included in the game. I like that. All right, just go right into the single player then, because, uh, yeah, why not? So right now we only have Kung Lao and Liu Kang unlocked. I'm guessing the other two are Sub-Zero and Scorpion, but I'm just guessing. I have no idea. Uh, I mean, as a kid, I played more Liu Kang than I did Kung Lao, but again, I was never very good at the game, though. Uh, we're definitely doing normal difficulty on this, because, <laughs> yeah. Miss the days of young me, not a care in the world, still on good terms with your cousins. Yeah, you had to beat it, and you think it was just a demo. Ah, uh, well, you know. <laughs> It'd still be cool if it was the whole game. Demo's still cool, but you know, whatever. Just picking on you. You're always running about 10 minutes behind in general. I mean, yeah, that's just how I do things. <laughs> uh, I shall be Kung Lao in spirit. Thank you, Rue. Yeah, this game is surprisingly quiet, isn't it? I have it turned all the way up on my end. I can probably add a filter to make it a little bit louder.
This is pretty freaking epic, man. I'm just sitting here enjoying it. <laughs> Very cool, man. Incorporating the fatalities into the cutscene. Love it. This is one hell of a way to get hyped for a game. Like, <laughs> just straight into the action. No messing around. I love the weird-ass mix of people that they always have in these games. Like, you have all these super-powered people, and then basically just have a cop. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> it's like with Resident Evil 2, you know? Hey, Mr. Noodle, thank for the five bitch here, love. Yeah, like with the Resident Evil games, for instance, man. You got, like, all the uh, the special agents and all that shit, and then you just got some, some B-cop on his first day. <laughs> Sorry you're late? Oh, don't be, Mr. Noodle. It is fine. Bruh, very cool. Very cool. Can't wait to get back and finish this fight. <laughs> Had some important things to do? What, what kind of important things did you have to do, Mr. Noodle? Because last I saw you were watching TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> Starting off in Goro's lair. Cool, cool. What was the funny game? Oh, yeah, shit. I forgot all about that. Um, it was American Choppers. Like, it wasn't even that weird. <laughs> it was just a... Uh... Try not to talk over dude here. Anyways, yeah, it was just American Chopper. She thought it was hilarious for some reason. I have no idea why. Like, it, it looks like a decent game to me. I don't know. I don't think it's going to be amazing or anything, but, like, it looked fine. And... <laughs> Alright, so, right stick is camera, which we can pan side to side, but don't have full control over. That's fine. L, All the L buttons don't really... Wait, what? So that puts us into a stance. Huh. Hopefully there's some sort of tutorial here because, uh, yeah, I don't know. X is jump. Very cool. The up arrow does nothing. Left turns on the map. And so does right. I like the uh, freaking... Shit, what's the name of those games? Diablo-style map that we can get on the screen here. That's cool. Oh, that changes the camera. Okay. Panoramic, normal, and close. We'll do a uh, panoramic. Seems like a pretty good way to go. To go about it. All right, cool, cool. So uh, a square, I'm assuming it is attack. Triangles, probably a different attack. Circles, circles, kick. I think. You think that's your block, if you remember correctly? Oh, maybe, maybe. Ah, oh, there we go. Perfect. Square, quick attack. Triangles launching. So circles, power. Oh, okay, okay. R2 is throws. Okay. Thought it was cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, that one didn't deserve two cool or three cools. It was, it was only, only, only two cools for that one, love. <laughs> now I get that from a uh, uh, community, one of the greatest shows ever made. Hey, okay, let's get the uh, the other camera up here. Got to get that that close action, man. I don't know any of the combos or anything for the game, so. 
it, somehow I shot some fire. I, I don't know how exactly, but <laughs> nice. We can we can juggle them, kick people into the fire too. That's pretty cool. Running attacks while running, press any attack button. Oh, okay. So that I'm guessing that's how I did the uh, the whole fire thing, right? I was just running and then attack. Yeah, and we do a uh, we shoot some fire out of our hands. Very cool. I'm sure there's some sick ass combos though if we uh if we get a chance to learn it learn them oh or if we don't get our ass kicked there there's got to be a block somewhere though so if R2 is not blocked there's got to be L1 L2 huh oh, oh okay yeah 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 L2 L2 might be blocked then I was mixing up L2 and R2 so if R2 is the the grab and throw then yeah. Hold R1 plus any attack to do special moves, okay? Oh, well that's... Man, they made that a hell of a lot easier than the old 2D games, didn't they? <laughs> no combos necessary here, man. You just freaking hold R1. Ah, dope-ass uh, uppercut there. Freaking flying kick. <laughs> love it, love it. The only thing it needs is like a, uh, a lock-on system. That's the only thing I'm noticing so far that I feel like the game's missing, you know? The ability to uh, lock on to a particular enemy or something. But honestly, like, so far it feels pretty decent. Like, some games it's absolutely necessary, I feel like, to have a lock-on system. Otherwise, it just feels like trash. But a lot like God of War, um, in this game, I don't feel like it's completely necessary. It would just be... It would just be a nice to have, not a need. You were Kung Lao, so you don't know jack about Liu Kang. Fair enough. Oh, if I remember correctly, this is before Katana learned about the truth of her dad. I know, like, nothing of the lore of, uh... <laughs> I almost said Lord of the Rings, man. My head's in the wrong space. Of the, uh, <laughs> the lore from Mortal Kombat. Wait, you must perform a block to progress. Lock on and block. Hold L2. R changes target. Hold L2. Oh, so we can lock on to people. Lock on block. There we go. Okay, so when we're locked on to people, we automatically block? Huh. That's a thing. You can't just be in over here being a badass. Destroying some Oni, man. Katana, stepdaughter, stepdad, not really care, but she loyal anyway, because she don't know. <laughs> like I said, I know nothing of the the, the lore, man. I, I know the name Katana. She was one of the ones that wore, well, the purple, green, or blue. Were those the three color, the three the three dress colors, if you want to call it a dress? <laughs> wonder if Melina is in this game, though. Have no idea. So if we're surrounded by enemies, perform multi-directional attacks. So it's telling us fight like, uh, act as if we're playing, uh, whatchamacallit. The, the, ah, uh, dude, I love how they're fighting each other. That's cool. <laughs> uh, but act like we're playing, uh, freaking Batman, man. Shit, I couldn't think of what the hell it's called. Gotta focus a little bit. I'm uh, <laughs> I'm really scared to die so early in the game, man. <laughs> oh jeez, we just had a freaking mountain fall on us. That's nice. So R1 is special attacks. Hey, I'm trying to learn the moves here, man. You gotta give me a second. <laughs> I remember which one of the uh, 3D games my cousin used to kick my ass in, man. Like I was so bad at it. Especially the 3D ones, like... I'm hoping, you know, now that I'm a little bit older, I'll be a little bit better at it, but... I, uh, it's a small hope, though. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead, okay. Every time we kill somebody, it looks like we recover a little bit of health. Ah, and we can also break shit to get health, that's nice. What is that? Can we... Can we climb? Do, like, a, a wall jump or something? There's definitely something red up there, and I kind of want it. She's the pretty fan lady, blue one. Okay. I remember I remember they all had different colors, but I couldn't remember uh like which one was which or anything. 
Oh god, you just remember it was Katana, Raven from Teen Titans of yours that really made me question why I like them so much. I I mean that's fair, man. <laughs> oh, can you like jump off each other or throw people up in the air or something like that? That's cool. So get people in the air and we can attack them in the air. Yep, that that makes sense. So it it's nice how even like these normal creatures still block and use like some AI, like they're not completely stupid. I appreciate that. Oh. Okay, why? I, I thought I was locked on. When I was locked on, I thought it would just automatically shoot towards them. But no, if you are like trying to walk away, it'll shoot whichever direction you're, you're, uh, you're walking. Regardless of if you're locked on. That is actually good to know. Uh oh, very cool. <laughs> I love the kick, man. That's perfect. Weapon combat. R2 to pick up a weapon. Okay, we can do that. You won't when it comes to the boss fights. Oh no. <laughs> I don't I don't think the skulls are particularly useful. Oh, there's an actual weapon laying there. Okay. Let's uh let's try that out, maybe. Oh, there we go. That's doing some damage now. Can't you, like, uh... Can you throw the weapons, I wonder? Oh, man, this might be a more visceral than God of War over here. Holy crap. Oh, we're being grappled. That's a fancy way to get up, man. Way to be a show-off, bro. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, okay, we just press R2 again to throw. That makes sense. Ah, oh, yes, explodey kick. That's the best weapon right there, man. Or the best move right there. It's a good old explodey kick. <laughs> a lot of fun. A lot of fun so far. I, I knew I would like this game, and that's what I was saying last night. I wanted to play a game today for the gauntlet that I knew I was going to like. Because, I mean, between between the birthday coming up and everything, I just uh, I wanted to have some fun with the stream, man. I didn't want to play more sports games or whatever. <laughs> Okay, so this weapon looks a lot more powerful, it seems like, but it's also very slow. Which makes sense, you know, two-handed weapons, slow weapons. That's fair. Ah, uh, the classic spike. Spike kill, spike death, spike pit, whatever the hell you want to call it. And he got all of his birthday presents already, so birthday over. I don't think that's the way it works. <laughs> I don't think just getting your presents mean your birthday's over. Nah, I still got all day tomorrow to uh, to enjoy, man. And tomorrow, by the way, I don't think I ever... No, I did. I did end up putting it on the schedule. But um, tomorrow we're going to be playing Kingdom Hearts 1 on the PS2. And then most likely just going to be playing more of Lord of the Rings since we're not going... Well, depending on how bad this storm that we're supposed to get gets, probably won't be playing anything on Sunday like we're like we normally do. Um, hopefully, I'll be out in the woods, but they are calling for a potential shit ton of snow. So, <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. Personally, I was always more of a fan of spin in place, and when enemies get too close, fan hurts them a lot. <laughs> you also need cake. I, uh, I'm more of a, a pie person, or ice cream. Yeah, I'm not a huge cake person. But, uh, a, a good birthday muffin, though. I could go for that, man. I do like me some muffins. Oh, that was a cool attack. So it seems like there are still combos. They're just not, like, the combos that, you know. Aw, <laughs> oh, dude, I love how it, like, stuck out of his back. Can we pick it up again? Yes, we can. Awesome. Cookie cake! Yeah, that's where it's at. I, I knew there was something, but look, something by the moon. Is that a missile? Are they are they are they launching rockets? <laughs> any any secrets that we can discover? Anything? No, it doesn't look like it. I wanted snow for the trip. I did want snow for the trip, 
I'm just worried about, I don't know if they'll plow the roads going out to the rustic campsite that I want to be staying at. So. <laughs> Ice cream pie from that one shop. That would be good, too. We've gotten them from there before. Uh, they're not bad if it's if if it's where I think you're talking about, but ice cream cake's pretty decent. I, but the only part of ice cream cake I'm really a huge fan on is the uh, the crumbly fudgy middle of it. That's like the best part, man. Fair warning: if you do get to reptile, he's poisonous. Pretty sure a good chunk of this area is too. I will definitely keep that in mind, Rue. Ends up being cool. You guys might like the Scooby-Doo comic. Yeah, it's Scooby-Doo Apocalypse, man. So essentially, um, you need to perform a fatality to open the gates. How? Perform combos to build up the fatality meter. Okay. Anyways, yeah. So basically, like, the Scooby gang just does what the Scooby dang gang does. And then, uh, but eventually, like, something happens. And the world is changed forever when monsters become real. So now, all of a sudden, the Scooby Gang is, like, the only group of people that can possibly save the world. So they have to just become badasses, essentially. Like, <laughs> I, I've seen the comic before, but I've never read it. And, uh, Mr. Noodle, though, she got me the first volume of it for my birthday. So. So, yeah, pretty excited for that. Uh, as much as I like this sword... I'm a little worried about whether the fatality meter is going to fill or not using the weapon, so I think we're just going to uh, go back to fist for a second. At the very least, we should get more hits in on each of these guys this way. Oh yeah, no, he's saying in the background, it's kind of hard to hear, but I just heard him. He said in the background, using weapons will not fill fatality meter, okay. So very, very good to know. The weapons are just so much more powerful. But then, I mean, fatalities are also very cool, so. I can hear them fighting over there amongst themselves again. <laughs> now, hit the enemy with the fatality stunner, L1. Okay, then what? Okay, it just tells us what to do. That's good, because uh, <laughs> if they didn't tell us the button combination, I'd be screwed. Hey! <laughs> Hell yeah! That was pretty sick, man. I like that. <laughs> Just <laughs> knocks his head off, and then a uh, freaking like volleyball kicks it into his head, his face, exploding his whole body. If you need further help, press the start button for more information. Okay, so I'm guessing it'll give us like uh, other fatalities that we can do and things like that. I, I kind of hoped that it would just keep showing them in the, the fatality screen, but... <laughs> so we can leave now, I know, but I see that we're, we're getting XP for this stuff, so... I, I'm a sucker for, for grinding and experience points and shit, so yeah, I can't help myself. Alright, let's, uh, let's look at the screen here real quick. Gotta try the chocolate cake batter ice cream from the place that's like 49 minutes from here. Yeah, it's really good, it's really good. Got it from Amazon, good to know. Gonna be so mad if you messed it up. <laughs> Can you? Like, if you press the wrong button, does it actually screw up? Scooby Doo. <laughs> I don't. I don't. <laughs> I don't think that's how you spell do. Love. <laughs> Thanks, Snooty. Uh, it does, but it's more fun to do a different one sometimes. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. DC Comics. Uh, it's the town's forty minutes out, and I'm still in state, or the one that's forty out. I leave state for noodle. Same, same state, same state. And, uh, it, it's really good. Yes, it does. <laughs> Alright, so, moves. Congratulations, by performing combination attacks and defeating multiple enemies, you have gained enough experience to acquire new abilities. A RPG elements. Love it. So, we got fatality. So, right now, just Shaolin Soccer is the only one we've unlocked. But we can, we can pay to unlock more. Does it, does it tell us how much it cost? I guess we can't unlock that one, because it's not an option. Team attacks the character can use in co-op, but we're not worried about that. So we got quick, power, launch, blah, blah, blah. Doesn't look like we can do anything with any of this. Specials. Oh, okay, so upgrades are in green. Gotcha. Good to know. Allows the player to get up quickly while on the ground, so we just press X. Allows the player to flip out and recover from in air. 
from an air reaction. Also very cool. Hold L2 and press the direction plus X to avoid enemy attacks. We can dodge roll. Get up attacks. We can do those as well. Okay, so we got in the air, press X. On the ground, press X. Hold L2 and press X to dodge roll. I think I can remember that. Let's get a... Uh, I mean, I'm going to be doing the square attacks most often, I feel like. So let's do that. R1 plus squares, regular fireball. R1 plus square, squares, high, low fireball. I mean, that's not the coolest sounding thing in the world, but whatever, let's get it. Will it show us the other ones? No, it won't. That's, that's fair, I guess. Uh, make sure to upgrade often. It makes them way more powerful and the animations get cooler too. It will do. Couple ice cream shops that way you want to stop at. Uh, we'll DM you later, Nate. There's another Scooby Apocalypse 2 with 36 issues. Wait, so is this like Scooby Apocaly Apocalypse Start Part? Jesus Christ, man, I can't talk. Is this Scooby Apocalypse Part 2? <laughs> like, I did not know that. Okay, I, I can dig it. I can dig it. It looks pretty cool, at least. Ouch, my coworker offered me $115 for two books for your classes, but the thing is, that's out of my pocket, and I could just get the digital versions cheaper or through the school. Yeah, man, school books are ridiculously expensive, like prohibitively expensive even sometimes. It's terrible. I, I don't understand how they can, uh, well, capitalism is how. As I, say, I don't get how they can get away with charging so much for stuff that's necessary. I was lucky the school that I went to included books as part of the... Uh, the 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 price of schooling you need an ally to solve this puzzle okay okay that's cool i really like stuff like that too where you know certain things you can only do whenever you have two or more players it gives you a reason to play the game with a with a friend or if you're really good i suppose you could just play both characters at one time hook up an arcade stick or something and <laughs> there's schools that do that yeah i don't know how common it is because I've only gone to, to one college, but uh, <laughs> that's what my college did, man. It was just included in the price of the, the courses, and they provided all of the books that we needed. I mean, we had to turn the books back in at the end, end of the semester, so we didn't, like, get to keep them to own them or whatever, but, yeah. I certainly appreciated it. No fair. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there was a my the school I went to honestly was pretty cool. It's it's sad that they uh, they didn't last too long. It was a it was a small town school, and uh, oh man, what the hell happened? <laughs> they were fighting each other, and somehow I ended up getting my ass kicked out of it. Like, anyways, yeah, it was a small town school, and uh, they they couldn't get enough students to stay open much longer after I went there, which is too bad, but, uh, oh well. Uh, oh god, they don't actually show you. <laughs> it doesn't show you the combo where you lied to me. <laughs> Crap. Okay, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to memorize that. Hold on. Fatalities. Shallon Soccer. Down, left, up, right, square. So I'm guessing you unlock the other ones by just learning them, right? So, what I do? Did I press left, right? <laughs> I know I did. <laughs> you're, you're the worst, man. Um, but yeah, because like, it didn't stop me until halfway through. So, I'm thinking maybe it you just do random things and unlock them. And then once you unlock it, it, it gets added to the list. I have to Maybe I'll try playing around with that a little bit more. But okay, so this one isn't too hard to remember. It's, it's just around the circle and then square. So, down, left, up, right, square. Down, left, up, right, square. We should, we should be able to remember that, maybe. My memory is pretty, pretty bad, but from what I can see, the book you got me is one through six. Yeah, I kind of figured with how thick it is, because most comics aren't, you know, all that big, but this one's pretty thick. Um, so I kind of figured it was one of those compilation things, but so is the, so this is volume one through, or this is one through six, and there's six volumes. So does that mean there's 36 all together? It's only one series is what you're saying? R2 to activate. I'm guessing this is a save stone. Mr. Noodle says yes. Okay, that makes sense. So I don't know if you guys can see, but the uh, whenever it's switching between things, the graphics get a little uh, a little more pixelated there for a second. That is because my RetroTank 5X, the uh, upscaler that I use, uh, is resyncing to whatever the sync signal is to find the absolute best 
or to give the absolute best quality that it can. Um, but some games switch between different single signals. Lord, words are hard. Um, fairly often, and whenever it does that, uh, <laughs> well, okay. So if I had gone across the bridge, maybe I could have gotten a special weapon. I guess I still can. Anyways, and so it causes the the graphics to get screwed up for a second once resyncing. R controls the camera. R3 gives us different camera. Oh, dude, that's an eyeball. I didn't notice the first time. So we only have panoramic and normal here. But if we go across the bridge a little bit, there was a weapon up top here. Right? Oh, I'm so glad I didn't land in the <laughs> the spikes. Because I totally missed that. Uh, I, would, I would like the weapon, though. Can we just can we just cheese it? Just uh <laughs> Okay, now that's gonna that's gonna get old quick. Oh wait, can we fatality him? Uh Wait, what well, it was it wasn't L1. It was L2. L2 and an X for dodging. Okay. And it doesn't seem like we can fatality the big dude, at least not yet. Yeah, no. So we probably, we either have to wear him down a little bit to be able to fatality him, or it's just not possible, one or the other. Good to know. <laughs> I love that. Just beating the crap out of his own dudes, man. You know what game just came out that I'm super excited for, and I kind of wanted to play today? God of War on PC, man. I saw, I saw some comparison footage. It's technically a little bit better on PC than it is on PS5, but it's not like a huge difference. Um, I do have it for PS4 and therefore on PS5, so I'll probably just end up replaying it on there, but I do want to pick it up on, on PC just to encourage Sony to keep doing that. Uh, no, that's not the way I want to go. Oh, how is this dude not dead? The little dude, not the big dude. He's got some cool attacks, man. They did some good jobs with the animations here, like... Like, they, they really did a good job of making this dude interesting, you know? So, can I... Nope. Ah, uh, don't get hit. <laughs> ah, no, don't get hit. Okay, that didn't do as much damage as I thought it was going to do to me, though. I'll, I'll say that much. It's the only one I know. <laughs> I think they just smoosh them together. You actually will die if you land on the spikes. Yeah, I, I wouldn't expect anything different. If you remember correctly, you have to get him down to near death before you can use a fatality on him. That sounds right, honestly. That, that's kind of what I would expect, so. Uh, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. I'm really glad that the combat feels nice in this game. Could you imagine a Mortal Kombat game with shitty feeling combat? Like, that would be the actual worst, you know? Uh, lock onto the dude, please? I can't see, he's too far away! And we can't change the camera in this area, it seems like. I guess it wants us to always keep an eye on the, the, the Oni Warlord. Which we should probably start attacking, because these little guys are just going to be non-stop. Yeah. That's how the Game Boy version feels to you? <laughs> yeah, I can imagine the Game Boy version would be a little rough. <laughs> okay, can't, can't, uh, can't fatality him yet. I'm sure the game will let us know. There we go. I don't know, maybe we just couldn't fatality this guy at all, I don't know. I've never played any of the uh, Game Boy Mortal Kombat games, but I've, I've, I haven't heard particularly good things about them, so I'm not surprised to hear that. <laughs> so the red, the red thing unlocks new fatalities. I think that's what Rue was saying, right? Or new abilities, just in general. Okay. <clears throat> R1 plus X for, for long jump. Okay. So murder these dudes real quick and go back up top and use our newfound long jump. 
Uh, try not to explodey kick into the spikes, maybe. Ah, very cool. <laughs> Sent him right into the spikes, man. Love it. I guess we didn't have to. We could just climb up here and do it that way. Okay. Okay, it's not an instant death. If we land in the spikes, that's good. <laughs> I thought that was something we could jump onto there. <laughs> that jump was a little, uh, a little, a little farther away than I thought. <laughs> Oops, my bad. <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> Let's give it another save in case I just send myself into the spikes again. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Oh my god, it's already been 41 minutes. I did not realize. Time is flying. Well, you know what that means then. We do need to take just a really short break while I stretch, get a drink, and uh, get rid of some pesky pre-roll ads. And then we'll be right back with some more bloody Mortal Kombat goodness. A little bit, don't I? Let me... where's my remote at? Here it is. I mean, I could just move this screen up a little bit. Ah, uh, they changed it. It doesn't work that way anymore. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. We'll go into the menu. I'm still getting used to... This is my... I use a RetroTINK 5X. And I'm still getting used to the new update. Um, vertical position. There we go. We'll just move it up a few clicks there. Something like that, maybe. Maybe that'll be okay. Oh, I don't like... I need the numbers. There we go. Okay, maybe that'll be okay. They added more features, like the ability to save profiles and whatnot. Some really neat stuff, actually. But, um, I have not yet gotten used to it, so... Here they come! Alright, so... We just gotta, we just gotta shoot. Just, just gotta aim and shoot. Uh, auto reload. Thank you. Honestly, I don't know how the hell we died on the tutorial mission. That uh, does not bode well for for the rest of the the game and our hopes of not being absolutely destroyed during it. But it's okay. I'm sure. I'm sure everything's gonna be fine. Can we? So uh, if the reticules aren't turning red, can we still hit the guys? Or are they too far away to be to be hit? I don't know, honestly. I see gunfire, but I don't see people. Oh, I just got hit by something. Hello? People? Ah! <laughs> okay. Yep. This is this is going swimmingly. I'd rather you didn't. Kill him, that is. I mean, you can kill him, like those guys, but uh, if you don't want to kill me, that'd be fun. I wouldn't mind living. All right. Everybody stretched out all right? Feeling good? Got a drink? I hope so. I'm feeling pretty decent now. My legs have just been sore lately, man. Getting, getting to stand up for a minute. M minute. Oh, Lord. The words tonight, guys. The words are uh, not cooperating. Getting to stand up and take a short break feels good sometimes. That's that's all I was trying to say. That's what I was trying to get out. But it's not cooperating. My lips, my tongue are not making the, the shapes that they need for my brain to say the things it wants to say. It's not nice. So, okay, so we have a special meter, too. I, I just realized that. So the light blue, or I'm sorry, the, the, the dark blue bar up there kind of stops us from just doing infinite special attacks. That's also good to know. Is this a... Oh, one of the red thingies. Yeah, there we go. Unlocked a new concept art. Okay, so that's like the, the special stuff that we can that we can do on the, the home screen or whatever. Just remember your favorite part of Armageddon. You could actually create a custom character and decide everything. I love that sort of stuff, man. Really, really want to play the Dragon Ball Z games. The the Tenkaichi and uh, Budokai and whatnot. Oh, I love those games. I don't know why you're talking about custom characters made me think about that, but... <laughs> and dude, you okay? I'm fine. Tired. I, I've just been exhausted. 
This uh, short vacation I'm taking for my birthday has been needed. Heck, those good dudes, <laughs> but good games, though. I love them so much, and I hope I can find the ones that I had, because I had the entire collection of them growing up, and a couple of them are kind of expensive now, so I hope I can find them. Guards a hold. Uh, <laughs> words. The guards ahead hold the key to the only portal on the island. Defeat them. Lock on to block. And also just make combat easier in general. Got it. Ooh, he can counterattack. Can we can we block all attacks or can we only block certain attacks? Okay, so so we don't like aim up and down automatically, which makes sense, you know? It's a Mortal Kombat game. I wouldn't really expect it to to aim up and down for us. Oh, for some reason I expected Kung Lao to be over there uh, fighting the other one for me and not have to come over here and fight it myself, but I guess, you know, that's just uh <laughs> that doesn't really make sense since we're we're not playing in in co-op mode. <laughs> oh god. I've taken some hits. Oh wait, wait, wait. We have we have fatality. Nice. One down. <laughs> I completely forgot about fatalities for a second. We should we should make good use of them, man. Especially whenever we're fighting two more difficult people. They're not like super difficult or anything, but harder than the other enemies that we've been fighting. You know what? I think I've done decided- Oh, you are right, Rue. That is a sick looking portal, man. Um, after we play Ratchet and Clank, and then whatever the next PS2 game is, I think we're gonna do God of War. The magic realm of Outworld. Shao Kahn hungered for power, for strength, for all things- The remake, arcade. that is. The blood he spilled in his brutal conquest of Outworld is impossible to measure or imagine, as was his hunger. Once all he could see was under his control, Shao Kahn turned his attention to Earth. But the Elder Gods had created a mystical tournament to protect Earth, known as Mortal Kombat. Shao Kahn could only lay claim to Earth if his champions were victorious in the tournament. Thus far, Earth's warriors have triumphed, saving Earth. But some fights only require a lone victory, and all can be lost with a single defeat. You have ensured peace for Earth once again this day. But there is no power in these medals apart from the knowledge you must carry into every battle. That no one is a champion alone. If one of us is in chains, none of us are free. If even one succeeds, the victory is ours. Liu Kang, you have defeated the sorcerer Shang Tsung. You have saved this realm as your forefathers did from his evil. You are Earth Realm's champion and hero. Thank you, Master Raiden. When next the tournament is fought, it will be my ancestors that are honored. Sonya Blade, you were a warrior before the tournament began. But here you have been tested and triumphed against enemies beyond Earth's measure. Thank you, Master Raiden. I know you have your chief officers to report to, but know that you will always have friends here and warriors willing to help you in your future missions. Isn't Johnny Cage just always kind of unbearable, to be honest? And I did, I, I DM'd you, Nate. You really didn't have to do that, man. I appreciate that. Thank you. Really. But, uh, but yeah, I DM'd you. Despite your natural shortcomings, you have proven yourself a valuable ally against Shang Tsung. You have the respect of myself and the Shaolin Order. Master. Ah, Kung Lao. Family honor is not won in a single day. It is one all the days of a life. It is one in fidelity and faithfulness. It is achieved through perseverance. There is not a warrior here that would have survived if you had not warned them of the traps in Goro's lair. Your family has been honored. I didn't even know they had kids, Rue. Well. <laughs> I said I know so little about the lore for, for uh, Mortal Kombat. I want to watch the new movie that came out, though. I plan on doing that here soon. For the moment, you have earned rest. Enjoy the peace you will find. MK10. I mean, I'll be playing a few of them as part of this uh, PS2 Gauntlet series. Assuming my uh, my disc doesn't break, it's <laughs> it's skipping a little bit here and there. This might be another one I got to put on the uh, get buffed list, cause <laughs> uh, okay.
tonight or tomorrow? Are you talking to... Are you talking to, uh, Nate? Uh, he's probably talking to Knight. Nate's a crazy person, so... <laughs> MK10, sadly, is PS4, but it's a good one. It actually focuses around the kids. Well, in about 20 years, then... Uh... <laughs> What are you oh godding, Mr. Noodle? I'm confused. You just dropping it on the porch, like I'll put on pants and get it when it gets here. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, what what are you oh godding? He's just throwing some stuff on the porch. It's not that big of a deal. So we are at an academy now. Very cool. Ooh, we can break stuff. Disappointed you really like the floating island area. No pants. <laughs> oh, the chat gets so random sometimes, man. Just <laughs> Mr. Noodles talking about not wearing pants. <laughs> Ruse just talking over here about floating islands that he really likes. Like, <laughs> pants suck. I'm a fan of pants. I'm not a fan of socks, though. Absolutely hate wearing socks. Okay, these guys are a little bit harder than the other ones. I, I need to pay a bit more attention to what I'm doing. I didn't mean to do a uh, fatality here, but whatever. That's what we're doing now. Socks always? Eh, socks are always optional. I think that's what you meant. Even fuzzy socks? Even fuzzy socks, Rue. <laughs> I just don't like wearing socks, man. I, I, grew, up, uh, I grew up without socks on. Like... <laughs> We were always outside, and when you're outside, you don't you don't wear socks. You just go barefoot. So, <laughs> plus they they pull on the little the little hairs on my feet, and and like they constrict your legs, and they're just all in all not all that comfortable. So I prefer not to wear socks when I don't absolutely have to. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm doing something. On my pooter here, I think I need to go here, and then go... Where is the thing that I'm looking for? Man, I am blind. Okay, that there. That, that. Okay, close that crap. And... Not here, goat heads, get your feet. <laughs> what? <laughs> Stop being so hairy. Look, everybody has some hair on their feet, okay? It's not like I'm over here walking around like a hobbit with, with some long ass hairs covering my entire feet. But I got I got a little bit of hair on my feet and I ain't, I ain't shy about it. Like, <laughs> he bought me fuzzy socks for Christmas and proceeded to tell me you had too many socks when he's the one who bought them. You do have too many socks. You do, but... I also... Are we dead? <laughs> that freaking hurt, man. But uh, I know you love socks, so I bought them for you. I'm sorry. If it's a problem, I can stop. <laughs> what is this one? Statue filled with the evil... Oh. Okay, so we, so we can't do it yet, is what he's saying. Gotcha. You have hobbit feet? <laughs> she did make me try them on. They were not comfortable at all. Was a uh, waste of two minutes. It probably didn't even take that long. But want the one shaped like cat paws? Of course you do. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. If you want to get some, some cat paw socks, then get you some cat paw socks, man. You need to get the ones with the grips on them, though, so you don't fall. Mr. Noodle is extremely clumsy. I don't know if I've ever talked about that on stream or not, but she is. She's one of the clumsiest people I've ever met. I need to grab something. Is this what I'm looking for? Yeah. Oh yeah, 
Go heads aren't over in the East. <laughs> look at the thousand, ten thousand bit symbol for an idea on how they look and how pokey they are. <laughs> uh, Go head sounds familiar to me though. I think maybe I seen them like on a YouTube video or something like that. I'm just I'm looking them up right now. <laughs> Google goat head plant. It's like one of the first things that came up. Images. Oh, yeah, okay. So we don't, I don't, yeah, we don't have that. But we do have something kind of similar, I I think. Um, it could even be the same thing, but I don't, no, I, I don't think it is. But we do have these plants, and man, it sucked. I would step on them all the time. We They grew out all over the place where uh, I, I lived during my, my young teenage years. And I, I don't know what they're called. We just call them, yeah, like stickers or, or something like that, you know. Um, but same, so, similar sort of thing. And they're they're really small. They mix in with the grass and the weeds and whatnot, so you can't really see them. And they just get stuck in your freaking feet, man. And they hurt like nothing else. But at the end of the day, I don't know. It didn't stop us. We just <laughs> we just kept going without it. Uh, we're gonna end up dying. We really need to just kill this dude so that we can get a little bit of health back. All right, there. Uh, that was hardly any health. Uh, can we? Yeah, seriously, fuck these things. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I saw that in the cutscene. I should have known we could do that. That was cool. I like that. <laughs> right. Uh, do all that. So, is that a secret area? Or do we need to kill this mask, dude? I feel like we need to fight this mask, dude. Even though it's probably going to kill us. If we can get him over here, maybe we can stick him up in this here. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Oh, you know what? We can just we can just fatality him. That works too. Always kill all the enemies. Yeah, you have to. Any or any game where you get experience, you have to kill all the enemies that you come across. It's not optional. <laughs> hey, 650 bonus XP too. Uh, no health for that one though. It didn't look like so that sucks. We can unlock new combos. Square, triangle, or geez, backwards. I think I'm developing dyslexia all of a sudden. <laughs> Haven't suffered from it my whole life, but now all of a sudden, I just can't. Triangle, square, square, man. So that's cool. So we could do that, or we can go back and unlock a new special, maybe? That one costs too much. We can get uppercut two, a second uppercut following the first that keeps enemies in the air. We also have R1 plus circle hold for two. Oh, so that's the, the bicycle kick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. Flip up. An attack where Liu Kang flips the enemy up into the air. R1 plus R2 triangle. Okay, so you want us to get special three, the next fireball? Looks like you want us to get the next fireball. We can, we can, we can get a little bit more XP and then unlock fireball. I'm totally up for that. What happens if we jump into that? I'm assuming we just die. Like, I'm not going to test it, but... Uh, ah, no, get up, get up, get up. Uh, okay, well, I, I thought we could make it. I obviously was wrong. Do these things provide health? Barely. Small health. Small being the key word there. Uh, can we, can we kill this dude over here for a little bit of healthy health? Nope, apparently not. <laughs> Uh, white, uh, and one of my gutters is, is, uh, is, like, hanging down off the front porch. Nate. If you can hear me. We... Ooh, can we kick you into that? Yeah, we can. That was awesome. <laughs> that was pretty sick. I don't know if that's how we were supposed to go about that, but it was really cool. I'm glad that we did. <laughs> can you put pants on now and open the door? I don't think he's here yet, but he's uh he's on his way, it seems like. 
Where are we going? Oh, wait, that probably destroyed the, the blockade down here. Oh, dude's portaling out of nowhere to, to murder us. Uh, can you get fired, please? Yes. Ow. I said, can you get fired? Not, 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 can I get sliced, man? I'm gonna die. This is bad. <laughs> You're on the road just looking for the house? Uh, you know what my car looks like, right? Just look for my car, man. Ah, oh, good. We got we got a decent amount of health there. Alright. We got we got fatality. Get up. Get up so I can fatal Oh wait, no, we don't have the fatality. Oh no, we do. I'm just a dumbass. <laughs> I was so scared. You hear a car outside? I mean that's probably Nate then. Five thousand eight hundred fifty. Not enough yet. We're getting there though. We really need to come across somewhere we can get health. <laughs> we really need to get some some actual health back, man. Oh, yep. We're dead. That that's it. <laughs> that was the end of it apparently. Shit. Hopefully there's a uh, like a checkpoint system or something. Game over. The hint is buy the bicycle kick. <laughs> Just do it. Just buy the damn bicycle kick. <laughs> that's what the game's telling us. Oh no. Get up quickly while lying on the ground. Press X to stand up faster. Yeah, I know. I told you. <laughs> you did tell me, Rue. I can't argue with you. You definitely told me to. Oh, and there's not a checkpoint system. Man, come on. Cut me a break. <laughs> That's all right. At least we weren't like super far into the level or anything. We need, we need weapon. Like the fatalities are really cool. And obviously powerful, but the weapons just do so much more damage than our fists do. So we're gonna we're gonna try to play it a little bit a little bit safer. All right, all right, I will, Nate. There you go, man. I messaged you. Okay, if we can if we can keep up the momentum here, maybe we can uh, just keep full health. I keep forgetting that we have power attacks too. We should probably use those every now and then. I'm sure that would help. Uh, also, not taking massive sword strikes to the face would probably help a ton too. Uh, I was trying to get him while he's still in the air. Oh nope, not happening. Stop hitting me, ba uh, Tarkata. Whatever. <laughs> I tried to say boy, and then I started to say Tarkata at the same time. Is he dead? It looked like he still had a little bit of health on his health bar. <laughs> I was confused. <laughs> All right, three down. Only like 20 more to go. But I think we have full health, or at least close to it. Don't get hit by that thing. That's what really screwed us. And there was nothing to do over there, so we can just ignore that direction. You're lucky it's a magic realm. Yeah. <laughs> Jump. Jump. <laughs> there we go. That's what, like, took all of our health last time, man. If we didn't get hit by that, I think we probably would have ended up being okay, to be honest. It's there. Thank you so much again, man. I have no idea what it is, but thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it nonetheless. You really didn't have to. Now you're going to have to tell me when your birthday is there, because you best believe I'm going to be returning the favor, boy. Also, I just glitched into a rock and then teleported out of it. What the hell was that? <laughs> that was pretty cool. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what the hell happened there, but... Also, I think this dude's a little bit confused. He doesn't seem to know what to do up here. You got a present and it's cute. Well, what the hell is it, Mr. Noodle? Share with the class. It's a magic rock. <laughs> the present or the rock that I phased into. <laughs> I know what you're talking about, obviously. I'm playing with you. 
Speaking of uh, things, though, Nate, what we do need to do one of these days is I need to get those old uh, broken consoles off of you, man, so I can try to work on them a little bit, get them fixed. Both. <laughs> oh. All right, so we did that now. I, so I think that's all we had to do up here. Yeah, we really weren't all that far into the level. And look at that. We still have, like, basically full health. If we wouldn't have gotten destroyed by that freaking thing. Oh, it's a Bulbasaur, man. A Pop Funko Bulbasaur. Hell yeah. Bulbasaur is like actually the best Pokemon ever. Growing up, Squirtle was my favorite. But then I watched the Detective Pikachu movie and absolutely fell in love with Bulbasaur. So thank you for bringing that up, Mr. Noodle. And thank you so much, Nate, for, for the gift, man. Now, Mr. Noodle's trying to freeze me to death with her fingers. <laughs> you know, we, we have gloves. We even have hot hands. You could just grab a hot hand and warm yourself up. Oh, that dude just, like, phased out of thin air there. That was weird. Also, how is the fatality going to work with him all the way up there like that? Oh, which consoles? I uh, don't remember exactly which ones. What was it? It was a, uh, a GameCube and an Xbox, I think were the ones, but I, I, my memory is so poor, I can't remember with 100% certainty. Ah, uh, you like dragons, so Dragonite is your favorite? Dragons, I mean, they were very powerful Pokemon, so I obviously like them, and I still like them, but uh, Squirtle was my first Pokemon, so it'll always have a special place in my heart. And then, again, Bulbasaur was the single cutest thing in the entire Detective Pikachu movie, so I, I'm always gonna love... Uh, Bulbasaur as well. <laughs> Go Noodle, use freeze attack. She's the worst. She always does that. Feet, hands, anything that's cold. She's gotta, she's gotta put it up against me. Just because I'm a human heater doesn't mean I want your, your, your frigid phalanges. Okay. Don't jump in the spikes. Don't jump in the fire. What are you doing with your life, man? There you go. That dude can go in the spikes, though. Um. <laughs> uh... You just liked how huggable he was? Snorlax. Snorlax is the huggable one here. Um, so it appears we weren't meant to go over here. So where the hell do we go? Do we... No, we can't jump there. That's definitely just... Ah, stop going in the spikes! What am I missing? I'm, I'm definitely missing something. Snorlax is the snap buddy? Hell yes. I'm very lost. Okay, well, there's more dudes over here to fight, so... What did I tell you about the spikes, dude? Well, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to. <laughs> Stop hitting me. Do you have a timer on the, the fatality? I feel like you probably do, but I don't know. All right, do we have do we have enough for for bicycle or not for bicycle kick? We definitely have enough for bicycle kick. For fireball too, no, six thousand five hundred. So we just need a couple more. Yes, just yes. <laughs> We're not. I, I I want the next fireball now. I want to know what the next one's gonna be. Is it just gonna be a more powerful version of it, or is it gonna be like a third fireball? Is it going to be like fireball rapid attack? I don't know, but I, I want to find out. It wasn't a favorite law. Just remember it's something you had that you knew I'd enjoy us talking about our favorite stars in Love and Bulbasaur and Detective Pikachu. Bro, I still appreciate it like a ton though. A ton. Like I, I didn't expect anything, you know? So the fact that you got it for me just out of the blue like that. And like, seriously, thank you, man. It wasn't a fit. Oh, I already read that. Beware of timer. You'll see. Well, I mean, I'm going to try to not let the timer run out. But before anything, we need to figure out where the hell we're going because. All right. All right. Got it. We just had to come up here again. A little bit of backtracking. That's fine. Would have been nice if there was a little bit of a hint that we had to do so. But it's all right. I can forgive it. The, uh, the way the health bar, like, takes a second to go down, it makes me think of... I forget the name of the game. Is it Bloodborne? Yeah, Bloodborne. Where if you, you hit an enemy back quickly enough after they hit you, you can regain a bunch of your health. It makes me think of that. 
it's obviously not the way it works in this game, but it's what it makes me think of. Now we definitely have enough for the next fireball. In air. Oh, it's just an air fireball? I mean, like, that's fine, but I'm a little let down. <laughs> I think I think we are going to go for bicycle kick, man. Bicycle kick. Bicycle kick. You want his spike bracelets? So, hold... Oh, I want to know how that works. I want to see somebody do this in real life. <laughs> Without wires or anything. Just just straight up. Uh, no, don't go in the fire. <laughs> Luke Keg, what are you doing, man? I love how these guys work together, too, to do their stuff. I keep thinking they're fighting each other, but... I love the noise he makes, yeah, for real. So the bicycle kick's cool, but I don't know. I don't know if it was worth, uh, if that's the one that I really wanted to get. I mean, the explodey kick does uh, just as well, really. <laughs> it's a little weird that the only way you can do it is by doing the explodey kick, and then... I guess maybe if you hold circle and then R1, and nope, doesn't work that way either. So you have to do the explodey kick, wait a second, and then do that. So it's just weird, isn't it? Trust me, it'll come in handy a lot. I mean, again, you obviously know more about this game than I do, so I would definitely take your word for it. Uh, nope, we did it again. Look. <laughs> we never learn, okay? <laughs> uh, game wants me to go that way, so go this way? Nothing. Damn. They need chests in this game. Chess with with items and secrets and things. Stream? What I do? What I do? Are you? Is it because of the spikes? I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't help it. I never learn. I get impatient sometimes, and I just gotta go. I just gotta go for it, man. And if that means taking a, a, a little bit of fire damage, maybe a spike up the ass, then so be it. You know. Oh, that dude just got messed up. This, isn't right. we do <laughs> this is going in your performance review at the end of the stream. Look, I apologize, man. What do you want from me? I'd say it won't happen again, but it probably will. <laughs> I need to check. The game... Nah, it looks fun. I can't remember if I ever, uh, if I put it back on limited, RGB limited mode. I was thinking that cutscene looked a tiny bit dark, but the rest of the game looks fine, right? So, should be good. Gotta get around to the bat. To the bat, guys. Hey, did we finally get somebody to fight next to us? Hell yeah. Well, dude. Johnny's just over here destroying dudes. Hey, Mr. Noodle with the five bitch here again. Thank you so much, love. I'm, like, tempted to look up other fatalities so we can try them and see if they work, but I'm not going to. Thank you for the happy birthday, love. I appreciate it. And all of the presents. I appreciate those, too. They really are amazing. I'm really excited to read uh, the Scooby-Doo Apocalypse one and to try all of the uh, definitely not going to be terrible games that you got me. <laughs> so many sound clips just played over top of each other that's a little bit of a pet peeve in games like whenever you have voice clips playing over top of each other it gets really confusing and not only that but like i'm pretty sure those were all johnny cage voice clips you have two squirtle funkos rag and diamond yeah i was telling mr noodle about the uh the diamond well the like golden diamond funkos that they made at one point um, I think, I think I showed her one of them. I can't remember if it was Squirtle or, or Bulbasaur or what, but I'm going to do an edit on the regular one and add sunglasses. Ah, for the cool Squirtle from the anime? Hell yeah, dude. Johnny Cage with his weird green punches and kicks. Johnny Cage is a weird dude, man. You just gotta, you just gotta accept that. Oh, it's after midnight now. Happy B-Day. Thank you, Rue. Thank you. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> like Noodle said, it's going on one o'clock here. Eastern time and all that, so... 
can we get in there maybe? There might be some way to get in the, the building, like from around the other side. We'll have to check. Speaking of it being one o'clock, it has already been another like over half hour. It's been, uh, I'm blind. About 33 minutes actually. So once we get to a decent spot, we're gonna have to take a quick break again. And I am feeling the need to stretch out my legs, so. Oh, I thought I thought it was saying Johnny Cage was ambushed. I didn't realize Johnny Cage was saying we're, we were ambushed. <laughs> um, I've, Mr. Noodle has been wanting one of those main Kun Funkos forever, man. Like, she's not kidding. <laughs> she's been talking about that forever. The bicycle kick just feels so weird to do. I like it, like it's a really neat animation, but if the the way you activate it is so weird. Also, I am not good at these group fights. Can we get one of these guys dead? This is not that spot. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, for a, for a decent break. Gotcha, yeah, no. <laughs> you wanna glam rock Freddy one so bad? I, you know what? I have seen some of them before. I was gonna say, I didn't even know they had Five Nights uh, Funkos, but no, I, I've seen them at at my retail job before, so. Yep, gonna get another reg for the edit, because you hunted the reg that you have now. Squirtle's number one accessory for me. So until, until uh, Detective Pikachu, Squirtle was by far my favorite as well, because of the whole, you know first game being Pokemon Blue and taking that as my first starter Pokemon. Have you already fought Katana, Melina, and Jade? First off, thank you for joining us, Hector. Happy to see you here, man. And, uh, yeah. As Rue said, I have not. This is my first time ever playing this game that I can remember. So I really know very little about it. <laughs> I, I, I know that it's Mortal Kombat. That's about it. I'm also very bad with the lore for Mortal, Com Mortal Kombat. I've played a couple of the uh, the older ones, obviously, like on uh, the Super Nintendo and whatnot. But yeah, need something sharp to release the defenses. So a sword, maybe. Hey, do any of y'all have a uh, a sword I could pick up real quick? Maybe I missed one on the way up here. Keep an eye out, but no luck. He told me a while back. Yeah, I did. I did ask him about it, like if he's ever seen one, or. Uh, or, like, what the prices were on them and whatnot. I'll also take a Monty Gator one. Is that... I don't know what that is. Monty Gator? Is that, like, another FNAF character or something? He's all about the garlic Pokemon now. It's my sister's fave, too. Most of her Christmas gifts were Barbasaur-themed. Yeah. <laughs> it blocked in the butt. <laughs> that's what that's what the auto mod got you for. <laughs> it thinks it thinks you were talking sexually. <laughs> oh, being a critical pain in the butt as I know much of the game. That's that's fine. That's you're allowed to say that. That's that's perfectly acceptable in stream. <laughs> you can say you're being a pain in the butt all you want. <laughs> oh lord. You have all of the evolves of Eevee. Okay, <laughs> I can't be mad at that one. Holy crap, we took a lot of damage from that thing. We might end up dying again. Let's hope not, but it's not looking good. I wasn't paying enough attention. I didn't see we were about to get destroyed by a freaking flaming boulder thing or whatever the hell it was. Alright, well, I mean, you kind of just left me with all these dudes over here. I kind of got to deal with them first before I come over over to the center courtyard, man. You know, you could have helped kill one or two of them, maybe, instead of just, just disappearing on me. Basically teleporting to the other, other area. Oh, man, we already got uh, 6,000 XP over here. We can get another power-up, assuming we don't die... Uh, lock on. Oh, thank God for that health. Otherwise, we might be dead right now. We uppercut. And juggle. Nope. No juggle. Explodey kick. I hope no more of those flaming boulders come our way. Oh, wait. Are they dead? I think they're dead. I think we got them all. 
Okay. I think they're, I think we're good now. Let's uh, check our moves out, man. Can't be mad at that one. These subtitles do not reflect the actual lines and it bothers me. <laughs> Sorry. So we got all kinds of combos that we can do. I'm terrible at combos. Special throws. Square, 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 R2. Square, square, circle, triangle. Auto launcher. More air combo hits. Run ender. That just sounds like something bad, man. <laughs> Triangle circle, then press anything. Okay, so that one's not too bad. Although I kind of like the fire ender. I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna get the fire ender. Why the main coon one's so expensive? It's just a cat Funko. I mean, they were probably you know highly sought after whenever they came out, and I I don't think they made as many of those ones as some of the other ones. At least I've never seen as many of them. Nice new. I saw edits of Bulbasaur as the other elements and fell in love with it. That does sound awesome, Nate. I've never seen those before, but cheapest one you found so far is over forty dollars. Uh, Fire Ender's decent, from what you remember. Yeah, we'll get we'll get Fire Ender. Fire Ender sounds like a good choice. Although at this point, I think we're at a pretty decent spot to take that real short break now, before we get into this battle that we're that we're supposed to get into down in here. You wonder, you might disappear for a sec. Well, perfect timing then, because yeah, we're gonna take just a short two minute break while I stretch my legs, get a drink, and get rid of those pesky pre-roll ads. So we'll be right back in like a minute and a half, two minutes, guys. Oh, right flank. I wonder like, uh, maybe, maybe we should be pulse pulsing a little bit more instead of just doing Oh uh, man, I wish there was a way to change it to like three round burst or something like that. Use left analog stick to walk around. Got it. I'm walking. I'm moving forward and backwards, side to side. 360 degrees of control. I'm taking a lot of hits too. Okay. Can one of you like take out that dude for me or something? Because I'm on it, obviously not doing a very good job of it, especially when these bombs are going off. Like, I don't know if there's any way to dodge those. Oh, that's, uh, it turns out I need to reload. I'm dead. I'm dead again. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> this is terrible. I mean, the other day when we were playing, the last game that we played was the Men in Black game. That game is hard as balls man like it is an insanely hard game i didn't expect this one to give me trouble though to be honest outside of it being a, a first person shooter and me not having a, a mouse outside of that i thought this one would be fine but my lord we've died twice on the tutorial mission <laughs> like reload oh i don't think he was talking to me i think he was just shouting out that he's gonna reload <laughs> Were you trying to make me go into sing mode again, Rue? <laughs> you saying you're upset he's spaghetti makes me think you were trying to make me go into sing mode. I'm kind of glad that it can't happen right now. I'm already fumbling over my words and struggling over here. <laughs> can, there's no way I'd be able to sing uh, my, my ABCs for five minutes straight. <laughs> No, this time it wasn't. You're still waiting to change your... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I got you. I got you, man. Well, then, I, uh... Well, I hope you you still can't put me into sing mode. <laughs> I don't... I, I don't think it's been long enough, but... Okay. Hey, there we go. Okay, so he opened up that, that gate for us then. Very cool. Very cool. I was wondering how we were going to get in there, and uh, now we know. Is Johnny Cage just going to disappear on me again, or is he actually going to stay and help this time? He's staying and helping this time. Thank you, man. We're so close to unlocking a or using another fatality that I think I'll skip the weapon just for a second. Uh, if we don't die first. Hey. Do we ever get health from dudes we do fatalities on? Yeah. Wait, did Johnny Cage just steal my health? Man, I don't care if Johnny Cage dies. Let that dude die. I want the health. <laughs> no, wait. Maybe we maybe we did get it. 
Alright, it seems like this fight's never gonna end, so I'm gonna go ahead and run over here and get the weapon. Oh, and that's a full heal, too. Very nice. Oh, it's a health upgrade. Even cooler. I could each set a limit. That's my only block. Yeah, well. <laughs> and that's why I did it. <laughs> Bit on it. I don't care about the box. You might. So we got a health upgrade. Very cool. We will take... Uh, no, we want the slow weapon. I like the, the slow and powerful weapon. I like that. This is the fight that never ends. Yeah, that's what it was looking like. <laughs> With them just constantly respawning. It seems like we're going to have to uh, cut these strings up here. Wherever that was at. Was it? No, it wasn't over here. It was the other direction. Right? I'm fairly certain it's the other direction. You just got caged. <laughs> cringe. Dude is cringe. <laughs> it's like a, a, a classic... Uh, I don't know. Just terrible. That's what. That just, just a classic. Oh, no, 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 no. Crap. I threw my sword. <laughs> I hope they respawned or something. It, it kind of suck if they don't. I mean, there was another one over there, so I'll go grab the other one. But can you imagine if you accidentally threw the two swords and then you were just screwed? Like, you wouldn't be able to beat the game. Okay, it did respawn. You'd have to reload. He's an actor. What did you expect? Yeah, I mean. <laughs> I guess so. What can I say? You're right. He's an actor. What did you expect? Oh, what does a ban word ban do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It just stops me from saying whatever word you want for for whatever the time limit is. I, I think five minutes again, but I'm not 100% positive. This cutscene, I, I don't think loaded right off my disc. Like I said, my, des my disc seems a little, a little scratched up. Yeah, no, it definitely didn't load. They should be talking and making noises and shit right now. This feels really weird with as quiet as it is. <laughs> I'm sure there's some terrible one-liners going on right now, too. And <laughs> it's uh, it's not working. Burn, baby, burn. I mean, that's probably what one of them was saying, but we'll never know now, I guess. I should probably take my disc out and clean it. Once we get to another save point, if we're not close to the end of the stream, we'll... uh. We'll take the disc out, and I'll, I'll do a, a quick clean on it. And, uh, yeah, maybe that'll help with the, the stuttering and apparently sound effects not being loaded. Oh, that was cool. Some slow-mo. I like it. Hmm, that could be fun. What word would you ban, though? That's the real question. No experience is awarded when an enemy has been killed using environmental hazards. Good to know. Still useful, but good to know. Ah, oh, speaking of save points, there we go, man. You don't know? Neither do I. You're thinking? <laughs> the word the. <laughs> that would be pretty hard. I think. I don't know. I might be able to. I might be okay with that. Raiden's over here looking all cool, and the other dude's just like spinning some fire, doing a, a weird walk, like he shit himself or something. Where was that save point? I just saw it. Uh, okay, well. See what I say about I'll definitely be walking into fire again soon, so <laughs> no promises on that. All of the English lexicon? What? <laughs> you, can, you can ban a word, not all the words. <laughs> You've thought about the and and? I don't know. Like I said, I think I might be okay with... with I don't know. I haven't had it happen yet, so I guess we'll see. But... <laughs> yeah, Nate. Good try, man. You're gonna you're gonna have to pick a uh, a, a specific word there, bud. <laughs> Can't just be all of them. The then law just wanted to say lexicon. I mean, I cannot say lexicon for for five minutes. We can do that. All right. So no no saying the T word. Starting after the last time I just said it. <laughs> <laughs> what time is it? It's 1.10. Okay, so that's easy enough. Until 1.15, we can't say T-word. I don't think it'll be too bad. 
I don't think. But we'll we'll see, I guess. It's weird that there's two loading screens so close to each other. See the problem with Ah, uh, shit, I just said it. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> okay, so it might be a little bit hard. Because what I was going to say was... A problem with that word is that it is just unconsciously said all the time. Also, are we supposed to kill these guys? Or are they just... Because they seem like they're just kind of dying themselves, you know? Oh, we just jumped right into the... Crap, man! <laughs> it's just... It's completely unconscious. Like... It just happens. <laughs> With English lexicon, you still would have had all other languages and non-proper English. I guess, but like, would you though? Would you have had all those other, uh, or, or non-proper English? I guess, I guess, uh, using other languages, yeah, would have been fine, but. Read my message without saying it. Got it. <laughs> oh, the one above that. The, the, the... Shit, man! <laughs> oh, God. That word, okay. Beginning was the Mortal Kombat tournament and Earthrealm won, but for some reason, those from the Out Realms are still attacking against the treaty. That other one, dude? <laughs> oh, no. Look. It's hard. It's hard. You said it again. I know I did. It's so unconscious. It just happens because it's just one of those words that, like, it's just always there, you know? Every sentence has it. I grew up in a generation that says like a lot, so like would be kind of hard for me too, I think, but <laughs> this is comedy gold. It's so bad. Or do you mean me jumping into fire constantly? Because that's pretty bad, too. <laughs> and we got medium health. So, wait. I thought I figured out where we were going. But I guess not. Are we not attacking this thing? Oh, R2 to interact. Okay, there we go. Ooh, what are we doing here? X. Okay, just, just mash X. I, I'm guessing we just have to get over the red line. Oh. We can just lock it on anywhere. So we could have kept going, I guess. Probably restore more health or something whenever we uh, we get we get higher. Both, but I think I found my sing mode replacement. I like this one better than sing mode, at least. So if you want to use this one, that is fine with me. I, had to, I, I gotta think about my sentences before I say them. <laughs> I can't just let it all flow. No, oh my god. We're just gonna start walking through the fire. Like, what's the point? Crap! What's... Why... Why try to dodge the fire whenever we're just going to walk through it anyways? I'm so confused from trying to think about my words that I'm not sure what this opened up. It killed some of the fires on the rooftops. I saw that. Oh my lord, this is... This is terrible. Can we do it again? No. Fire. Well, yes, fire, but... <laughs> Where it put out some fire somewhere. Up here? Nope, not up here. Over here. Ah! There we go, okay. I didn't see where it put out fire. <laughs> oh, shit. See, I didn't look over there. Well, we're only going to do one at a time, but thankfully, it's 115 now. So, we will start that one now. So, we can't say the F word 
and not the bad F word. I'm just glad I can say the because <laughs> I although I thought it would be easy to say or to to talk without saying the so who knows we might end up saying that F word a bunch too. I guess there's a <laughs> only time will tell. But I think it'll be easier than than not saying the. Is it going to be the same thing with X? X a bunch of times? Yeah. Just all the X, man. X going to bring it to you. I uh, got to fill it up. All the way to the top. Yeah, buddy. Did we break it? <laughs> there we go. Extinguish all of that F word. <laughs> oh, it's so dumb. Like, <laughs> extinguish all that F word, man. <laughs> Sounds weird. If anybody just, like, hopped in right now, they would have no idea why or what the hell we're talking about. Just... <laughs> oh, shit. That's why the stuff's there, man. To, to interact and have some fun with it. It just turns out that I kind of hate singing. <laughs> Do you just go to sing some Run DMC? <laughs> what, what, X gonna give it to you? <laughs> Look, you can't you can't talk about X and not say it. Like, come on. We gotta get it all. I don't know if there's really any benefit to filling it all the way up, but I gotta do it, so. <laughs> yeah, I'm impressive. I got them X mashing skills. I played Mario Party. Where the hood at? <laughs> I mean, I agree. Exactly, man. Uh, that's not our sword. Get rid of that. Nobody wants that piece of junk. I'm glad that... As you... As you banned the F word, we kind of ran out of F word to talk about. <laughs> well, I guess not all of it. We are still extinguishing the F word. <laughs> Okay, there's, there's a lot of mashing here. Once or twice, I think would have been fine. But, like, they're overdoing it a bit here, man. Yeah, I was disappointed with it. Uh, come on, fill it up. There we go. Bumping some easy E earlier. I don't listen to much old school rap these days, to be honest with you. That shit beat F word, though. Oh. <laughs> uh. All right. Uh, what do we got next? That's a that's a cool cinematic shot they got going on there. So wait, are we? There was another another thing we had to pull to to put out some more stuff, right? Can we just like jump over here? Yeah, there we go. I got it. I got this. I love how stupid it sounds. <laughs> what old school rap? <laughs> yeah, me too, man. <laughs> Me too. Old school rap, some dumb shit sometimes, but... <laughs> now, I mean, I listened to it a lot growing up, though. Ugh. These days, I just don't listen to a whole lot of rap music, to be honest with you. No, you're not saying the F word, but that is... What I know what you meant, Rue. I was picking on you. <laughs> I don't as much but started listening to Sublime, and I was like, shit, now I want to jam to some easy. Yeah, I mean, these days... I mostly listen to, I don't know, I guess lately I've been listening to a lot of, uh, a lot of Bring Me the Horizon, and, uh, damn it, almost had you. Mm. I got this. And, uh, oh, shit, I, I'm, I can't remember the name of the dude. Orange Rex County, I've been listening to a lot of Orange Rex County, Pofu, a lot of Pofu. Which, I mean, he, he kind of raps, I guess. That's that's rap-esque. So wait, where are we going? Are we going back up the way we came? Jumping up here again? And then... Going where? I need to pay a little bit more attention whenever the cutscenes are playing out so I know what the hell we're doing. <laughs> okay, so we can't go over there because the, the statue full of evil energy... Motionless and White and Ice Nine Kills are your main go-tos. I've never really listened to Ice Nine Kills, not to lie to you. But uh, I do like Motionless and White, though. I've been listening to them a fair bit. Uh, Korn released a new song, so I, that triggered some some Korn listening. 
Can we, like, jump down there? Nope. That looks like the area we need to go to, but I'm assuming we have to destroy that statue to go down there. Can we go in here? Nope. All right, where the hell are we going, man? This is just back around to the beginning again. Do we not talk to Johnny? Maybe we need to... Maybe we need to talk to Johnny or something. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can we go up in this building? Well, I don't know if we're supposed to, but there's a thing in here at least. Johnny Cage has been unlocked in versus mode. Hey! That's cool, I guess. Johnny. Buddy. Pal, what are we doing? Can't go through the door. This is still locked. We just did a giant loop and I didn't see anywhere to go. What am I missing, guys? I'm missing something. Is there, like, a hidden path? A wall that we need to knock down? I know I'm blind, but are we just going backwards? I guess we're just going backwards. That works. Funeral degrantments and rainy day. You've been bopping to that so much. I will try to remember to do so. My, my memory is terrible, but I will try. I can actually, you know what I will do is put that in Google. Funeral, D-E-G. Do you trust me? Listen to my words as you continue your exercises, for you will need to remember them later. Rainy day. Rainy day. Derangements. That makes I a little more sense, you but, you know. <laughs> more. I believe he now defies the elder gods themselves. Baraka could not have come with a legion of mutant scum had Shang Tsung not been aiding him. With his defeat in the Mortal Kombat tournament, he will be anxious to prove himself superior to you and take his vengeance. This will make him reckless and more dangerous than ever. I had hoped you would have time to heal your wounds in the tournament, but I was gravely mistaken. You must go to Outworld. We must take the battle there if we are to save Earth. I am weary after the tournament, but rest is a luxury afforded only to the dead. Of course I will go to Outworld. And what of you, Kung Lao? What do you say? Of course. Take the portal to Outworld. Mm, some amazing early 2000s voice acting in here, man. Better than the movie, though. <laughs> I've always listened to a ride variety lately. It's been anime rap, some musical songs, and rock. But today, you're just feeling like revisiting the high school, middle school playlist. Yeah, I listened to a... Uh, I can never remember the dude's name, but a, uh, a YouTuber that does anime rap and shit like that. He did one on uh, No Game, No Life that he released today. I listened to that. And uh, I, I listen to those every once in a while. This won't count in your review because we got lost in this part for a long time too. Yeah, it's just, I don't know. Whenever you just randomly backtrack in a game, I, I get confused. Without their, I, there may have been some sort of indication and I just missed it. That's perfectly possible, I suppose. And I'm assuming, oh no, okay. It looks like we're maybe jumping down here now. Yeah, okay. I thought we were just going to keep backtracking, but then I saw the portal open up down here. Excellent. You don't trust that Raiden? Yeah, I mean, his eyes did glow green there for a second, so... Like, I think that's fair. <laughs> Something about him doesn't scream trust. I, lo <laughs> I love the weapons just, like, hanging out of their faces and shit. Like, very cool. But can you get away from the spikes a little bit, man? So I don't have to keep uh, running into them myself whenever I'm trying to murder you? I'm trying to pick up the weapon, not do whatever the hell that was. Been listening to a bunch of Granson slash Oliver Tree and Hobo Johnson. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, Hobo Johnson's always on my playlists. Like, <laughs> love Hobo Johnson, man. Along with anime rap and the musical stuff. Uh, don't run into the... We didn't touch that. Lies. This guy's the bigger name, guys, you've been listening to. How much longer are we going to go stream? Not a whole lot longer. I usually quit right around 1.30-ish. Um, since I was a few minutes late getting started today, it'll probably be a few minutes late stopping. But yeah, it won't be, it won't be a whole lot longer. Although tomorrow, I don't remember exactly what time I planned on starting. I want to say, I want to say 6 to 12 was my plan. Let me pull that up real quick here. Uh, pull up my stream schedule. What time am I streaming tomorrow? Schedule. 
PS2 stuff for my birthday. Yeah, six uh, six in the afternoon my time to twelve in the a or twelve midnight my time. So I don't know exactly what that would be for you, Rue, or for anybody else out there. I guess you're what three hours behind, so three to nine, uh, your time is what it would be. Um, and yeah, we're doing we're doing Kingdom Hearts one, and then a little bit of the Lord of the Rings, probably probably about three hours of both, give or take. All right, we're definitely gonna save here. I don't. I mean, I planned on going for like another eight minutes or so, but I don't know, honestly, if we'll have time because it seems like these save points are a little far apart. So we might actually just call it here. What kind of name is Hobo Johnson? <laughs> that's a, that's the dude's... Uh, I mean, he's not technically a rapper. He kind of is, but like not exclusively. <laughs> he's really good, though. I really like him. He does... Uh, some interesting music. You live stream, I saw you hit it. Look, I don't think I did. I think it was swinging away from me and I got close to it, but I think the hitbox just hates me. And <laughs> found Oliver Tree because of Hobo Johnson, actually. I feel like I've heard of Oliver Tree before, but I'm not 100% positive. Sounds familiar. The name sounds really familiar, but I'm not sure if I've ever listened to him or them or whatever. I put six, yeah. Yeah, fair, fair. That ends around 10-ish, you think? Yeah, like, you're, you're Pacific Standard Time, right? West Coast Time? I think you're three hours behind us. Because it's 1.30 here now. I don't know for sure what time it is. Uh, you're... Oliver Tree still have the weird haircut and wear windbreakers pretty much 24-7. Oh, that's why I know the name Oliver Tree. Mr. Noodle showed him to me before. From the album covers, you see he does. <laughs> okay, performance review time. Give... Me a wooshy student status. You have potential, but you need to stop hitting spikes. <laughs> Other than that, doing good. Solid seven and a half out of ten. That's fair. I, I can't even argue with you. One hundred percent. You know what? I think. I think if anything, you're a little bit lenient there, Rue. Yeah. <laughs> Eleven thirty right now for me. So about two hours behind, actually. Okay. 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 Yeah, two hours behind. So yeah. So your time it would be four to ten. He dated Melanie for a while. They were supposed to do some music, but they broke up. So you guess it's never going to come. Yeah, that's why I remember about it. I re remember that name, I mean. Because you brought it up because of the whole him dating Melanie thing. And I remember you talking about him, like, looking really weird and shit. And how you thought it was weird that he was with, uh, he was with Melanie. We need options. We're not going to be playing anymore, but if I end up playing this game in the future on stream, which I would like to actually, I'm having a lot of fun with it. So this is definitely going on the I would like to finish list. Um, how? Fatality. Oh, you just use left and right. Okay. Well, I was hoping there would be, yeah, different volume levels. Let's turn speech volume all the way up and then we'll leave music and sound kind of there. Because this game is just a little bit quiet. Oh, dang, that would have been awesome, too. Melanie and Oliver Tree doing some music together. I don't know if I've ever actually listened to his music or not. Mr. Noodle may have showed me some, but if she did, I don't remember it. And, oh, man, does it already say we're 10% of the way through? Yeah, no, we'll definitely have to finish it, Rue. You demand that I do, and uh, I think we probably will. Because, I mean, according to this, we've played for one hour, one minute. They must not be counting, like, load screens and cutscenes and stuff like that, because I've been recording the VOD for an hour and 45 minutes. Uh, so. <laughs> and I didn't start recording the VOD until right before we started the game. They had a video of him eating spaghetti, Lady and Tramp style, and it went through her gap. He was grossed. <laughs> God. That's so weird. They're both weird. I think they do deserve each other. <laughs> Yes, and surprisingly, no, they don't, which is awesome. Oh, man. Oh, you know something? I, I remember. So AGDQ, for anybody that doesn't know, AGDQ is this giant uh, speed running marathon that they do two twice a year, every year for charity, right? Well, one's SGDQ and the other's AGDQ. Um, there was a game that I played way back in the day. It was a, a not well-known and decent uh, God of War clone called uh, Garshas the Monster Slayer. And to the best of my knowledge, I had the world record speedrun in that game. Now, before anybody gets impressed, 
I only had the world record speed run because I don't believe there was any other times on the leaderboard. I never officially submitted it or anything. So like it was never official, but I did look it up and I don't remember finding any. I could be I could be wrong or maybe it was on a different site than the one I was looking at or whatever. But point is, I saw last night that it was on AGDQ and I'm a little bit sad that I definitely don't have a world record speed run anymore. <laughs> um now, something that was official at one point in time, though, I was one of the top five players in the world for a game for a little while. Um, I thought about trying to go for the number one spot, but my brother, who I was uh, practicing the game because I wanted to stay better than him at it, he kind of dropped out of the competition between me and him. So I kind of lost interest after getting to my goal of top five in the world. It's a, a little tiny free game. It's very short once you know how to beat it. Uh, it's called The Longest Sword. A lot of fun, and it, like I said, very short, and I was one of the top five speedrunners in the world for that for a little while. Um, but, like I said, I, I, I stopped kind of doing it. The videos might be up on one of my main stream, or my main channel on YouTube, I don't know. But, yeah, it was pretty cool, though. Nice, gonna head out, guys. Have a good birthday stream later. Yeah, have a nice night, Ruth. Thank you for being here, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for the resubscription as well. Always appreciate that. And uh, everybody else on stream, thank you for being here. I am going to be getting off myself. So, wait, not like that. I'm going to be ending the stream. So, <laughs> so <laughs> thank you all so much for being here. And uh, I hope to see whoever can make it tomorrow for the actual birthday stream. For a little bit of Kingdom Heart 1 goodness and probably not, but maybe finishing Lord of the Rings The Third Age. Phrasing lol, yeah. <laughs> Oops. All right, guys. Sorry you can't make it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I know what your plans are for tomorrow. Nothing. <laughs> oh, God. Anyways, for the last time, thank you so much, everybody, for being here. I appreciate you all. Bye-bye, and have a wonderful night.